When I listen to your music, I think it's pretty clear that you seem to have a pretty big love for, for soul music. Yeah. Uh, where, where does that love of, of soul music come from for you? Uh, like just, uh, I mean, I grew up singing country like with my mom a lot, but I think they had a really big record collection. I think the first time I put on like Otis Redding, um, I just was really taken and I've been digging at it ever since. And I think like, I don't know, just I've just randomly come across like really great people that have really kind of helped me move through hard times. And I just, I, I guess it's just the feeling and the sense of healing. Who told you that you could rewrite the rules and do you really take me for a big goddamn fool? Cause I Is that something that's important for you to pass on to people through your performance? Yeah, I think um, like um, before I got into music kind of seriously as like a young adult, I was, you know, maybe uh, 20 or something. And I went through a really, really difficult period of like, a, you know, about a year and a half, a real struggle with my own mental health. And I think when I came out of that, I came out, music was one of the things that sort of Help me make the decision to like be here and then i started performing you know open mics and stuff like that and after that i just sort of felt like i had come to this place with music and that sometimes other people felt what music had given me and there was kind of this little circle that happened of 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 that and so i just people were drawn to me that were grieving or going through really hard times and da da da, da and so that circle of what music does for me, and then sometimes it does it for other people, um, has been an important part of me understanding, like, okay, this works. It's interesting as an artist, you have so many people assuming so much about you yeah. and your music, you mm -hmm. know, and they, some people want to latch on and identify as mm -hmm. like, that's mm -hmm. my truth. And it's like, yeah. maybe, but like, I'm doing this. To well, I always think that's like kind of amazing about a song or something because you write it based on like experience that you had and then it goes out into the world. And really like at that point, it belongs to whoever listens to it. And, and I feel like a really good song is kind of a canvas where a whole bunch of people can um, see themselves in it and, and the facts of it and the, and the truth of it for you, it, it's really irrelevant. Like, you know, what does, you know, Harvest Neil Young mean? But it means like he's a master at creating these kind of landscapes that fit into everyone's life. <laughs> 